got a call from Brandon. Asking for our permission and blessing to marry our princess. Of course, Bob said yes. Today, friends and family, we are gathered here not to witness the beginning of what will be, but rather what is. So, Brandy. And Larissa, never ending, everlasting love, straight to the heart, is the definition of marriage. Brandon, can you take Larissa to be your wife, to have, to hold, from this day forward? I do. Larissa, do you take Brandon to be your husband, to have, to hold from this day forward? Sure do. Absolutely. Let's do it. <laughs> now, by the power vested in me, God, Jesus, and the Holy Spirit, I pronounce you husband and wife. Brandon, you may kiss your bride. Present to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Brandon. I am of the man that Brandon has become, the kind of husband he will be, and the son that he was. The reason Brandon is the man he is and the character he has is because the love that Sophie has um, always had for Brandon. It's unmeasurable from day one. But also the love that Sophie has for Larissa is spectacular and I've seen it. And it's unconditional. With ongoing love and patience, understanding, hugs, and at times, yes, some tears. But most important, compromise and everlasting is on your side. My Clarice, Mijo, Mr. and Mrs. Gonzalez, congratulations on this day. Cheers. your heads be in agreement about the things that really matter. May your hearts be united in love this day and ever after. May you always lend a helping hand no matter who's in need. May you find only health and wellness and long, long lives in need. May you grow in faith and find in Christ what your soul requires. May your passion for each other meet all your desires. I love you both.